name's Fred, and I collect fort. I know it's weird, but this is so interesting. Anyway, school's tomorrow, blah 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 blah, blah the usual. So, um, today's video, I'm gonna probably talk about what I had and, like, what happened to me last year in school. Cause I'm a really awkward person. If you haven't figured it out. Hunter, don't interrupt! Oh. And please ignore my horrible, awful hair. I need to shower, and I haven't showered yet, but I will later. Don't worry, I'm not that big of a pig. Pfft. Well, anyway, back to the main subject. First, I need to have a couple of updates. Gotta grab my trusty notebook. I'm just kidding. I don't have a handy dandy book. Nope. At least Steve can have that. Not Joe. Did you check my niece? I have no IMVU anymore. I quit that, and if you see, I kind of took it off of some of my videos because I made a Twitter so oh I had it for a while I just never showed it but if you want you can follow me and I just for quick update quick updates but the only problem is Twitter is meant for phones and I have a juke remember this guys remember this yeah my phone kids these days not those big screens kids are playing these days <laughs> Cracking one drop. I, this got ran over by a car, okay? My second channel, I'm trying to make a new one because my second channel is broken and I need a new username because I do not like anime anymore. And that was when I was a creepy webo or weebo. Weebo, weebo, there's the word. Weebo, or whatever. And we don't know what that means. Here's the definition Someone texted me. Someone, my friend Natalie. With a picture. Ah, 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 ah. Uh, uh. So you get Natalie for interrupting my video. So in the beginning of the year, since my I was my normal webo, weebo, weebo, there it is, stage. And I used to wear crappy anime clothes and I used to think I knew Japanese. I called everyone a baka. Aho. And I went Nandeo a bunch of times because I thought that was Japanese. And if someone said it wrong, I teach people. And some girl, the leader of the Japanese club, thank you by the way, because after Japanese club, I stopped liking Japan. Japan. She kept telling me I was wrong, and I had an argument with her, and I said it was in a book. And she told me it was wrong. So, yeah, but then after that, that club was so boring. Something clicked. I snapped! I can never snap! <gasps> but something clicked, and after that, I stopped liking Japan. So, yeah. So I was really awkward, and I used to talk about gay porn all the time. Yeah. Another time is I was minding my own business, going to art, second semester, and there's this door. And it closed and like it closed behind me and I got s my backpack got like stuck on the door so I was basically sitting there like this and like struggling to like get out of the door and people saw and I was like <laughs> that door gone <laughs> but not like that cuz I don't know and that wasn't my only fight with random objects like that. I also had a fight with the vending machine cuz if you're for if you're a person who has no friends at lunch or this ever happened to you, you have no friends at lunch, you become the most awkward person ever cuz I for a semester 2, I had like no friends at lunch except one day. And then and then that class got moved or something for them so I had no friends on both days because we have like day A and day B. Anyway, I was alone so I was like, oh, I'm hungry so I'm gonna go to the vending machine because I don't buy lunch food. So I went to the vending machine, I got my food and I had like a book in one hand so I was like, oh, I, my hands are full so I can just get it with using one hand. 
So as soon as I reached in, I got my chips, but then it closed on my arm. So when I pulled it out, it got like caught right here. And my arm was stuck, so you see me like sitting there struggling to get out oh, my chips or food. And then people watched me fight with it, and eventually it closed right here. I had to pull, and it became all a big bruise, came all right here, and it was all purple and everything. It was the worst thing, and I just walked away like it was nothing, like, oh, it, it didn't hurt. When really in my head, I was screaming in pain because it hurt so bad. It's like someone pinched you really hard. Like, really hard. If you ever been pinched, it's not fun. It's not fun at all. That's basically all the school awkwardness I remember. I think... I don't know. And I finally got video production because I went to my guidance counselor today to get my schedule before school starts so I know where to go. And I wasn't supposed to get video production. They switched me out. So I switched myself back in. Now I have video production. So prepare for hopefully seeing better videos and better acting because I can act, see? Don't shoot me! Don't shoot me! I'm I'm <laughs> Look how horrible I got shot. Like, don't, don't shoot me. Ah. Thanks for watching, and if you're in school, try your best to have fun in school. One other thing, Avion Row, if you didn't know, look at my difference between us video. They commented on my video because they watched it, and oh my god, that made my day. So that's it, and enjoy your day and school year.